All right, we're back. Lawson just scored for Cannon. And uh, Fitzgerald scored for Meigs County. 23-16 the score. It'll be the Lionettes and a score, I'm not for sure, I think that was uh, France. Cramps that scored, we'll give it to her. And here comes Lawson off a of steel tally. We'll step and lay it up and in. Lead is 11, 27, 16, and a timeout has been called. 5.54 remaining to go in the first half. Want some delicious home-cooked type food? Head over to Parsley's Market in Delhi at 809 Bradeville Road. Whether it be a sausage or egg and bacon biscuit, hot breakfast, or a delicious fill-you-up plate lunch, Parsley's is the place for great food. Breakfast is served from 5 a.m. until 10 a.m. and lunch from 10 a.m. until 2 p.m. Parsley's Market in Delhi is a hometown local business and proud to support local Cannon County events and organizations. Call them today to order food to go at 615-563-1402 or stop by anytime between 5 a.m. and 10 p.m. at 809 Bradeville Road. Parsley's Market in Delhi. Back here, we apologize for all the technical difficulties. We're out in Decatur, Tennessee. 27 to Fort 16 and a layup coming up, no good by King and there's a foul against Cannon County. And that's gonna call up against uh, Teeter and Teeter's third. Teeter, yeah, Teeter's out there. I didn't even see her out there. Krantz will re-enter the ball game for the Lady Tigers taking the place of Ansley Haddon. And Schumberg will bring the ball up the floor. Top of the key. Teeter will stay in the ball game with three fouls. Here's Krantz, jumper up, short. Lawson gets the board. Comes over to Alexander. Alexander reverses in the lane, dumps over. That's going to be a charge. Yep. Twenty to fourteen, substitution comes in. That's Bush coming in for Lawson. Also Holt back in for Teeter or Teeter, yeah. Inbound comes up to Brown. Brown goes over to Krantz. Krantz to the right side to Haddon. Haddon drops it over to Brown on the wing, and Brown's going to lay it up on on Bush and missed it. Rebound pulled down by Holt. Holt, baseball pass too hard for Bush. I think they told Brown that if she gets 21, 21's attention, take it to the hoop because uh, Bush has got two fouls. Here we see him spread out. Left side baseline over to, uh, to number three. That would be uh, Howard. She badly missed that shot. Krantz, Lawson. Tally, driving, stop, shot, no good. Rebound pulled down by Jenna. And <laughs> goes to Bush. Wide open is Pelham, and Pelham goes up high. Brown will pick up the foul. Two shots. Free throw, one up, no good by Pelham. Second free throw coming up. That one is up and that one's good. So one of two for Bella. She's got five and quickly up the floor comes Krantz and company. Over to Lawson, drops it off inside. Howard makes a spin move on Pelham. Badly misses and Alexander with the rebound for the Lionettes. Cannon Cut, can cut the lead to single digits with a bucket and Pelham muscled it in. Seven for Pelham, 27-19. Long pass down to Howard. Howard draws the double team over to Fitzgerald. Fitzgerald's gonna drive it over to Krantz in the corner. Krantz gets it 
to the high post. Right side, Fitzgerald. Fitzgerald drives baseline, spins back. Over to Lawson. Lawson goes to the left side underneath, finds Howard. Howard, weak side, nobody draws defensively. She's got five. Long pass. Holt cross courts it over to Bush. Bush ball fakes, lays it up too hard. Rebound pulled down by Pelham. It'll bounce around and bounce out. Foul going to be called on 23, Laney Fitzgerald. They said it's her first, although I, yeah, second. Free throw by Pelham. Up, no good. Hits the back of the iron, ricochets right back out. Number four comes into the game. Ainsley Bales, second free throw is good by Pelham. No, not, not a, no good. And it's still 29-20. Ansley Bales is who number four is. Pass to Fitzgerald. Pass inside and that's gonna be a foul on Pelham. Fitzgerald will step to the free throw line. Free throw is up and it drops in. Two forty-nine left to go in the first half. Ten point lead for Meigs County. Make it eleven. Six points for Fitzgerald. Meigs County slapping on a full court press, pass overthrown, and Brown comes, or excuse me, Haddon comes up with it. Lawson drops it off to Fitzgerald again, goes up, shot, no good, rebound pulled down by King. King comes across half court. Addison right side, picks up the dribble, finds it down underneath the bush, layup, no, but a foul. And she got hacked by B Bales. So Bush will go to the free throw line for two shots. Free throw, one up, no good. Second free throw. That one's short as well, 0 for 2. And here's Bales right side to Krantz, drops it back to Bales. Bales fires it over to Lawson, and Lawson with an easy layup, and she blew it. Rebound pulled down by King. Out goes to Holt. Aniston fires it, but Fitzgerald's right there watching the eyes and takes it away. Here's... Pass over to Lawson, Lawson's jumper, no good. Rebound tipped into the hands of Holt. Aniston goes up the floor with it and Fitzgerald blocks it. Teeter will check in, also number 12. Angeli King. There's a lot of Ansleys here on this Meigs County team. Here is Fitz, uh, Abby Alexander driving. Ansley King, Ansley Madian, Ansley Bales. Where's the other Ansley? I thought there was another one. How about had number 11? Okay, that's Madian is what it's supposed to be. I guess number 11. Free throw one up, no good. Second one though is good. One of two for Alexander, that's her first point. 
10 point lead, 31 21 with a minute 21, and Teeter almost had the steal. Got to be careful, doesn't want to pick up her fourth foul. And they're calling her back. Lost it, reverse dribble, goes in the lane, shot. Actually, I think she was trying to pass it. Tipped out of bounds, it'll be Lady Tiger Ball. Howard will check back in for Lawson. Inbound, number 12, that's uh, King. I go over to number three, Howard. Howard left side. Teeter falls down, but Bush fell down, but Cannon, with all of the chaos, gets the ball back. 48 seconds left. Alexander, baseline, top of the key. Here is a three from King and a bomb from King. Drops the lead down to seven, 31-24. Loose ball, picked up by Cannon. Teeter, 23 seconds left, and Lionettes will hold on to the last second. Left side, King. King gonna drive against Howard. Back it up, 11 seconds, drives it again, finds over to Bush. Bush Kids gets it over to Teeter, shot up and good and a foul. What a shot by Teeter. Probably asked her to make that one again, she couldn't. Foul is gonna go against Ansley Madison. That'll be number two and Teeter will get the and one. Missed the free throw. And here comes King, wide open three, no. Wait a minute, let's see what the call is here first. And that's gonna be half. We 